How's it going, everybody? What an absolutely beautiful October day. Got the fall foliage coming in. On my way to the gym right now. Gonna get this pump in. Very excited. And on my way there, I'm gonna talk about working out after ACL surgery. So I'm around two months after now. And I feel like my workouts have been getting more consistent and better. And it's very exciting because um, I wasn't able to work out like uh, I normally could for a long time. And it still won't be at 100% for a while, especially for leg workouts. Upper body though, not too bad. But let's date back to when the injury actually happened in July, um, July 7th, uh, 2023. So this summer. So ever since then, like, it was just a confusing time. I was in bed, you know, so I couldn't really work out, especially when I didn't know what the injury was at first. Got the MRI, all, all this, until I knew the plant. Oh, look at how dope these trees are looking. It's nice. Peak fall foliage. Anyways, yeah, I didn't know what was going on. But then I finally found out what was going on. I, it's the ACL tear, uh, meniscus too, whatever. Uh, planned out the surgery and, like, uh, had my physical therapy going for prehab before the surgery and then I could get more advice of what I can and can't do um, I did a lot of stuff with bands so I have bands so I was doing different things for my chest for my uh, arms like different bicep curls things like that um, I have this pull-up bar at home uh, the, the type you know what I'm talking about the type you could just put on um, the door so I was doing a lot of pull-ups and push-ups I wasn't for a while because I wasn't confident using both my legs on the ground but uh, with the instability of my knee from the injury because I had difficulty walking. I couldn't walk for like a month. Uh, some people can walk just fine after their ACL tears. I couldn't walk for a few weeks. It took me a while. My knee was very unstable. It kept uh, like it would keep buckling. Push-ups. It took me a few weeks before I started doing push-ups, and the PT told me I was good to do it. And even that, I was doing a lot of it with my good leg, had, like being on the ground, and my bad leg, uh, putting it on top of that. So basically, like I was doing the push-ups with my arms, um, and the gravity from my legs was just on one leg. If you know what I mean. So I was doing a lot of that, and once I felt comfortable, I went to the gym a few times before the surgery. Oh, and obviously I was doing my physical therapy, so I had to do that to strengthen my leg before surgery. Nothing crazy though. Uh, had my surgery, so August 18th, so it was around six, seven weeks after. So that's a good amount of time of losing out on gains, you know, so got a bit smaller, obviously. After the surgery, obviously I couldn't work out. Um, had to rest up, it's a serious surgery, um, had to take painkillers, a lot of meds, um, things like that and that nature, had my big leg brace on, obviously couldn't do much. So first few weeks was resting, doing my physical therapy, um, waiting to get all my stuff cleaned up with the stitches and everything and like f just following directions very thoroughly and didn't go to the gym for about a month. Mid-September is the first time I went to the gym and I got very skinny. Um, I was looking very skinny. I'm usually around 170. Um, I probably lost around 10 pounds. Um, looking very skinny. A lot of muscle mass gone. I just, yeah, yeah. Especially my legs. My legs were tiny. Getting, getting better now each day. But started going to the gym. Now it's been a month and it's feeling a lot better. But the thing is, I can't, now I can do a bit more, but I couldn't especially then carry heavy weights and putting that pressure on my legs and my knees so the only way i could do heavy weights is doing machines where i'm sitting and i just, you just put the pin in and set it where you don't have to carry like the plates and stuff so nothing standing and unless it's very low weight and now i'm starting to do gradually a bit more and more because in my physical therapy i can do my leg exercise with a 35 with 35 pounds so i just determine it based off that and i talk with my physical therapist and that just ask a million questions what i can and cannot do so recently i've been doing more and more um i've been doing a lot of machines and i feel pretty strong i've been doing a lot of calisthenics a lot of pull-ups a lot of push-ups 
a lot of machines and you know like honestly you don't need everything like like sometimes that's all you need i feel very strong the other day i pounded out 30 pull-ups like are you kidding me 30 my pr for pull-ups even when i was lifting crazy weights like i was benching 225 uh, max like things like that i was like putting up good numbers and my max pull-ups was like 22 or 23 right now i mean i'm not looking as big but in this past month um i've i've uh, i've gotten some gains back but doing even doing these simpler workouts and not as much and it sucks can't do like as much legs but now but gradually doing more and more makes it more and more exciting and i just know i'll get back with the mu muscle memory and the, the hard work i know the the legs will come back eventually it may take six to 12 months but i know they'll come back and i'm already two months but if you take it all into consideration so july uh august september that so that's three months of consistent usual working out that i missed out on that's a good amount that, that's a lot of time you know it's gonna just gotta make that comeback and feeling better and better every day so for all you guys out there that are going through this just uh going through these injuries just stay patient and everything will be all right everything will be all right um yeah it's uh it's exciting it's exciting I'm, I'm going to the gym right now beautiful day and it's exciting to be able to do more and more and just a blessing to even be able to go to the gym be able to go outside just breathe you know just be living life you know so it's okay if i'm not doing the crazy stuff i did before but it's still a blessing to be able to go to the gym i wonder if my upper body is gonna be crazy jacked and my legs are gonna be tiny like i don't know what's gonna happen but in the end it'll all be all right i'll be playing soccer i'll be i'll be doing everything i can do before so now arrived let's get this pump have a great day everybody hope that gave some help and insight to anyone curious and going through the same thing i uh, got my brace right here so i gotta wear this a little bit just in case but yeah everybody have a great day take care keep grinding keep enjoying life i will see you guys next time like comment subscribe see y'all later peace jump, jump.